It has been America's destiny to bear the leadership of the free world and to carry that heavy responsibility on its shoulders. But my country, the United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland, has been proud to share that burden and to walk alongside you at every stage. The United Nations, in need of reform, but vital still, has its foundations in the special relationship. From the original declaration of St. James's Palace to the declaration of, by United Nations signed in Washington and drafted themselves by Winston Churchill and President Franklin D. Roosevelt. President Trump's victory, achieved in defiance of all the pundits and the polls, and rooted not in the corridors of Washington, but in the hopes and aspirations of working men and women across this land. Your party's victory in both the Congress and the Senate, where you swept all before you, secured with great effort and achieved with an important message of national renewal. So it is my honor and privilege to stand before you today in this great city of Philadelphia, to proclaim them again, to join hands as we pick up that mantle of leadership once more, to renew our special relationship and to recommit ourselves to the responsibility of leadership in the modern world.